I'm going to focus on what I can do in my life and on the systems and structures that I'm putting into place. I'm going to be taking you guys along. So in Fly Lady, I'm doing um, uh, the Miracle Morning Routine. I'm doing the and do energy you need to face your day. Don't want to wake up. First of all, I'm going to start off with my green smoothie. I have some arugula in here, a half of banana, my supplement, my amazing grass, uh, super greens here, and this. All right. That looks good. Got my smoothie, and it is really good. And I did, I went and put my hair up. I got dressed. Let me just show you to my uh, shoes. Uh, this is me getting dressed head to toe with shoes. I get a little bit of makeup on, if any. Um, and so I'm going to swish and swipe in the bathroom. If you guys don't know what that is, it's like when you go in the morning to get, get yourself ready for the day, you take a minute to wipe down your mirrors and your countertops and that kind of thing. So I realized I did not have the things that I needed under my sink to do that. So I'm putting those things under my sink and I'm going to go swish and swipe and it's really funny as I was thinking about that this morning I actually heard Marla singing that in my ear swishing swishing or swish and swipe uh, there's a song she sings on her YouTube channel so uh, if you're new to my channel I'm basically a burned out life coach I took that head off and after you know a health crisis five years ago and the doctors uh, a, a, a trip to the emergency room and the doctor saying make changes or you're gonna stroke out I took uh, I, I did after that I had three more months I had to finish my my work projects but then I put them off to the side stepped down and pretty much retired my coaching business closed it and I've been working on myself and little bit of work on the side freelance work on the side just to uh, keep the lights on you know uh, and I am learning a lot about myself now that I've actually created the space and time in my life to take an honest look at myself the smoke is disappearing and I'm beginning to see my life a little more clearly and some of the things that I, uh, I I'm breaking through a lot of barriers so I'm just gonna be vlogging with you guys about this this is my space um, my accountability space you guys help me so much because you hold me accountable and I hope that what I share um, supports you on your journey as well that's all I'm here to do right now is just to share my journey so um, that's what I'm going to be focusing on in 2021 and I'm going to be taking you guys along. So I'm doing Fly Lady, I'm doing uh, uh, the Miracle Morning Routine, I'm doing that. And uh, oh, I did order a new planner, so I'll talk to you guys about that again uh, later. But I'm going to be developing habits and tracks to run on. Hopefully in my sharing this with you, you can sort of decide if if any if you want to try any of these things I mean I'm not affiliated with anything that I'm trying I'm just um, these are things that I have known about for a long time and I've even referred clients to and I'm taking it on for my own <laughs> my own uh, wellness most of the housework is on me that has never been that way I've always had the kids always pitched in and did quite a bit I'm realizing more than I ever knew <laughs> um, I should I need to give them more credit because they did a lot uh, and um, my my husband is always willing to pitch in John will vacuum he'll do dishes he'll anything I ask him to um, and so I but he works a lot of hours and I just can't say to him honey I know you've been working for 10 12 hours today but I've been reading um, to try to make my life better and I would like you to clean the toilets because I just can't do it today um, so it's about me managing my time uh, and and I want to create tracks to run on I don't want to be just feeling unorganized and uh, thinking okay what do I have to do next I know what I have to do next it's right there in my list uh, what fly lady calls the control journal I call it sort of an accountability folder is what I've always called it I consider her an expert in this area that I want to grow in right now so which is it is personal development her program um, in coaching we used to say if you want to help somebody get their life together uh, get them to go clean out their closets like really like your physical environment 
makes such a difference in your mental mindset, all of that. It's all interrelated. And the fly lady knows that. Um, Marla knows that. So, and that's what I'm finally understanding is her system is designed to really support that, per making that consistent, permanent change, you know, in your behavior. It's a, it's behavior modification. <laughs> so that's what I need. Um, as I learn to do my life differently. And I don't want to just do it by default. I want to do it intentionally. And so that's why I have chosen, I'm going to try this system. Um, like for the first quarter of 2021, I bought her new book and I am, that's the book I'm going to be reading for the month of uh, January. I always read a new book every month and that's what I'm going to be reading this month. So, all right, I'm going to go downstairs and work out and then I will uh, see what else is going on in our my day, <laughs> and I'll share that with you because uh, I am just vlogging today. As the first step is means getting dressed to your shoes, it won't give you the can-do energy you need to face your day. Don't wanna wake up, I might be dreaming. I might be dreaming. You're stirring things up, my heart is beating. My heart is beating I won't let go I can't say no My heart is yours So I say here we go You do that something to me You do that something to my heart I give up, feel my stuff I'm like a spinning top You do that something to me You do that something to my heart I give up, feel my stuff And I keep spinning After I learned the dance for Burmese resolution to get organized and the conclusion i came to was that i had never established to needs rather than plans i could have avoided the fever if i had been in the habit of taking my level was high and i was not used to do this it ain't my style it ain't my style you see right through me i don't want to no, I don't wanna hide. I won't let go. I can't say no. My heart is yours, so I say here we go. You do that something to me. You do that something to my heart. I give up. You don't stop. I'm like a spinning top. You do that something to me. You do that something to my heart. I give up. You don't stop. And I keep spinning. You see right through. day for any of us living in uh, America, in the United States, um, no matter who you are, where you are, whatever your politics, this has not been an easy day. So kind of, I was, I actually was, um, kind of putting the wrong lid on. Let me take this off. So I have to put my blender lid on. Let me just rinse this really quick. So, um, I was listening to a podcast while I was on my bike today, and uh, I listen. I try to listen to different points of view, um, you know, and really step back and be able to make room in my life for a bigger perspective. This up real quick. I spent about thirty bucks on this from. I thought it was Walmart.com. I actually said to somebody on the comments. It was walmart.com. I actually just ordered it from Amazon. Uh, I don't have an affiliate link. I'm not an Amazon affiliate right now. I just share links sometimes. I'm trying to just get away from, I don't wanna focus on affiliates and things like that in monetizing my YouTube channel right now. I just wanna focus on sharing the things that I wanna share um, in my life. Um, oh my gosh. Okay guys, 
Now, if you are tracking your points on like Weight Watchers, I, tr I just track points on the iTracker Bytes app, iTracker Bytes, because I mainly like it because, um, and I have the paid version, I pay like 30 bucks a year or something like that. It's very inexpensive. I use it just to keep me accountable. I mean, I don't have a ton of weight to lose. I'm gonna bring you guys in here now. Um, well, let me just, uh, let's move you over here. And, okay. Let me just get my stool. And I can sit and talk to you guys. <laughs> so, all right. So, um, I like it primarily because um, it holds me accountable. I can track my uh, points for the day if I want. I get 23 points a day with my, I am trying to lose a few pounds. Uh, I did, I met my goals at one point and then I just sort of gradually put on an extra six pounds that I would like to take off. But I, my main goal is just to be healthy. So I don't mind carrying a few extra pounds. I really don't mind at all. Um, but I don't want to gain any more. So, uh, but this, um, really, really helps me, um, after I always have a protein shake after my workout now. So if you're counting, if you're counting your points though, here's what I wanted to tell you. This is like the, the half a banana is like two points and this, a scoop of this powder is one point. Now I blended it with milk the other day, 2% milk. And that had like five points for just a cup of the 2% milk. And I scanned it with the scanner. So that bumped this way up. So today I'm just mixing it with, with water. And I just have to say, this is just as good with ice and water. And that's zero points. Plus it's, you know, it's water. I'm hydrating myself. So I'm doing that. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. So what I wanted to say is wherever you are on the, on the, uh, in politics, it's a sad day for all of us, all of us, it's a sad day. I'm gonna focus on what I can do in my life and on the sy systems and structures that I'm putting into place uh, to, because this, you know, God's given me this. This is my domain, my home, um, my family, my friends. There are certain things that are in my domain for me to, uh, to take care of, they're mine to take care of. Uh, I have some responsibility outside of that as well. Of course, we all do, but right now, I know that this is what I need to focus on. So today for, for the fly ladies in zone cleaning, um, zone cleaning this week is kitchen and I am working in my kitchen this week. So uh, I'm gonna just uh, declutter my kitchen real quick. It's it's quite a mess. When you're down and you stare at your window much better let me just show you real quick uh, my kitchen sink is clean well look at that one little speck there it's bugging me I thought it was clean so the habit of the month for um, fly lady because fly, the fly lady system is all about building a new habit every month and I'm starting from the beginning as a fly baby so the habit for January is to clean your sink shine your sink she calls it 
um, so that it's it's clear. And then on this side, or I have a dish drain in here because there's only two of us, so I just wash a lot of my dishes as I go. I don't always use the dishwasher for everything. And in particular, I rewashed or I washed these Christmas tins that I need to put away. Uh, you know, my Christmas cookie jar and things like that. So I washed that. I'm gonna. Uh, dry that and get it put away real quick. In the book, uh, she says to declutter your kitchen and only have things out on your counter, appliances that you use at least twice uh, a week. So uh, that's what I'm working on. I still have my Christmas um, bar up here. I'm going to put all that away. It's very cluttered. I have radios up here on my fridge. That's because John and I are both uh, amateur radio operators and Lordy, you should see his ham shack, but that's a different story. Um, I'm going to, uh, so that stays up there. I have my bread maker up on the fridge uh, because that's such a great place to keep it. And I try to use that quite often. And, um, but most everything else I do keep stored away. But one of the things she says is to take all the magnets off your fridge. I'm like, oh, really? I'm gonna do it. Uh, I'm gonna do it. I, it's, I always put things on my fridge uh, but I'm going to take them off. And instead, I'm going to uh, start pinning things on my bulletin board, uh, which is around the corner there. I'm just going to clear my refrigerator magnets off my fridge today. I will say that's a little stressful to look at a blank white refrigerator <laughs> and um, I couldn't part with all of my I have my Christmas stuff here I'm boxing that up but I ended up putting some of the meaningful magnets here on the side with my coffee bar uh, for now because I just I had to and then um, my pictures that my my niece draws for me I'm going to um, Put them on the side of my cabinet over my bookshelf um, over there I need a place for those and I'm gonna put them over there they're art to me <laughs> and I have to have them out so um, yep so I'm gonna put those over there and I'm just gonna use some commando strips just the strips to put this up there so uh, all right I'm gonna I think I'm gonna just take a little break. Uh, I'm gonna continue to take down my Christmas decor. I still have a lot to do, uh, but I'm making progress um, in this kitchen. So, progress, not perfection. So I am all showered and ready to go. I'm just wearing a, a t-shirt and a uh, flannel shirt. I'm, I gotta head over. I got a text and a computer. We, are, we dropped off a computer, John's computer. Um, to get a new um, hard drive put in it and we're getting a solid state drive put in it because they're sturdier apparently I don't know anything about that but that's what John said get a solid state drive put in there and it's done so I'm gonna run pick that up Walmart box and he just rang the doorbell and I just brought it in let me see if I can open this without scissors not really um it doesn't look like it's packaged real tight so I think I can just open this up 
maybe. <laughs> maybe. Oh, goodness. Oh, I can't get this last piece. There we go. Okay. All right. Let's op open this up. And this is just household things. Uh, a few groceries and household items that I would normally get in the Walmart uh, pickup. Yes, there's cat food there. So I get cat food sometimes. My daughter has two cats. So I order cat food for her. And, all right, this one's a little weird, but I got some almond milk. Um, almond breeze. Thank goodness I've been out of this. And so I, I got a couple boxes of that. Three. <laughs> um, and then I got... Some more of my um, hair, skin, and nail gummies. Love this stuff. And I got some B12. And I got some of Roscoe's favorite food. And then I got some of the uh, peanut butter granola cups. Uh, this is John's favorite snack. I got two boxes of those. And then I got um, some shampoo and conditioner. This is a shampoo and conditioner that I like. And it's anti-frizz, oil therapy, Dove. And I got two. I looked at the price, the unit per price, and it was, uh, they had bigger containers, but it was actually cheaper per um, unit. You know, it was cheaper per ounce to buy uh, this than it was the bigger container. So I just got two of the smaller ones. And I really only wash my hair two to three times a week at the most. And our favorite um, coffee, the Pete's Major Dickinson blend. And that's it. That's our Walmart haul. I'm going to go put these away. And Roscoe and I are going to go take a quick walk. Yeah? Yesterday there was some. Alright guys, well that's going to be it. We finished our dinner. Um, John's working on the computer. I'm getting ready to jump on a call. So that's it for today's vlog. I will be back in a couple days with another video. Take good care and I'll see you next time. Bye.